Hello, my name is Tanya and I'm from the Netherlands. I'm doing this testimony for Ablayan Avut Ayub. Here I have two photos of Ablayan. Ablayan is 34 years of age and he's an Uyghur artist. I'm not related to Ablayan. I'm doing this testimony because at the moment there is nobody to do it for him. Earlier there was done a testimony by Darren Byler, anthropologist at the University of Washington. Ablayan was first detained between January and March 2018. His likely place of origin is Guma. His likely current location is Hotan. As he's originally from Hotan, it is likely that he's being held in the Hotan prefecture, but we are not sure about this. His health status is unclear. His current detention type is unclear too. And we don't know the reason for his detention. Also, it is likely related to the themes of his music. Ablayan Avut Ayub is a popular Uyghur singer, song writer and dancer. His pop-influenced dance music often references Uyghur traditions and poetry. His music is widely popular with the Uyghur children. According to Radio Free Asia article from May 15, 2018, Ablayan was arrested in Samyu village in Houghton Guma County. News of his disappearance first circulated via the social media. It was later confirmed by the Financial Times in March 2018. This victim is included in the list of prominent detained Uyghurs available at shahid.biz. For further information about Ablayan, I refer you to the Wikipedia page. Suspected human rights violations committed against him are Articles 9 and 19. Article 9 says, nobody has the right to put us in prison without a good reason to keep us there or to send us away from our country. Article 19 says, we all have the right to make up our own minds, to think what we like, to say what we think, and to share our ideas with other people wherever they live, through books, radio, television, and in other ways. My requests to the government of the People's Republic of China are the following. I want to know why Ablayan was detained. I want to know where he is detained at the moment and how he is doing. I would like his family being able to visit him. But for most, I'm requesting the Chinese government to release him immediately. Thank you very much for your attention.